The streets of St. John's are expected to be busier than usual as a record number of cruise vessels continue to dock in St. John's Harbor. Drivers and road users are being urged to adhere to parking and traffic rules, especially when cruise ships are in port. Traffic warden Roberto Dickinson explains the strategy used by the Antiguan Barbuda Tourism Board to manage the smooth flow of traffic during busy days. Well, so far, we have um, been really handling it well. The taxi men, most of them will tell you that they're pleased with how we handle it. Because as you know, when cruise ships are in port, there are certain areas where certain taxis are allowed to park. These are authorized taxis from the St. John's Taxi Association. Um, the streets that they're allowed to park are on Low High Street, Low St. Mary Street, and the Lower Recliffe Street, respectively. Dickerson commends most citizens and residents whom he says are abiding by the rules. And they understand that we are not a large country where we can have a cordon off area all the time for just for this event. So what happened? They're more cooperative. But we'll work along with them, especially the delivery trucks. We try to assist them as much as possible. We have a lot of space for them to pull off and deliver while not congesting the flow of traffic. The ABTB is urging people to stay informed about cruise ship days in St. John's and to continue obeying traffic laws. On cruise ship days, I'm appealing to residents to please tune into the media, the radio, the television, and also social media, so that you will know when a cruise ship is in port, so you can park accordingly. Brian Anthony for ABS News.